Hello, and welcome back once again to Jeffinnegan's Wake, the project where I, Jeff, read the book Finnegan's Wake to you one page at a time, one day at a time, put it up on the internet for everybody to hear. Let's just knock this out. We are on page 188. Here we go. All the morning since your last week, wet bed confession, I advise you to conceal yourself, my little friend, as I have said a moment ago, and put your hands in my hands, and have a night's long, homely little confiteur about things. Let me see. It is looking pretty black against you, we suggest. Shem Avik. You will need all the elements in the river to clean you over it all, and a fortifying Pope's priest power bull of a tender to Booth. Let us pry. We thought, would, and did, Cur, Quicked, Ubi, Quando, Quomodo, Quotes, Quibus, Oxillus, you were bred, fed, fostered, and fattened from holy childhood up in this two Easter island on the pie jaw of hilarious heaven, and roaring the other place plunders tonight of you, blunders what's left of you, flash a slash can, and now, forsooth, a nogger among the blankards of this dastard century, you have become of twosome twin minds, twin minds, fornin, forninest gods, hidden and discovered, nay, Condemned fool, anarch, egoarch, here is dark, and you you have re reared your disunited kingdom on the vacuum of your own most intensely doubtful soul. Do you hold yourself then for some god in the manger, Shehoham, that you will neither serve nor let serve, pray nor let pray? And here, pay the piety, must I too nerve myself to pray for the loss of self respect to equip me? For the horrible necessity of scandalized sang, my dear sisters, are you ready? By sloughing off my hope and tremors while we all swim together in the pool of Sodom. I shall shiver for my purity while they will weeping, weep big for your sins. Away with covered words, new solemnities for old bath sheet baths. That inharmonious detail, did you name it? Cold Calder, G. Victory. Now, opera bro of underslung pipes, John Jacobs, while yet an adolescent, what do I say, while still puerile in your tube suit, tub suit with button legs, you got a handsome present of self raising syringe and twin feeders, you know, Monsieur Abgot, in your art of arts, to your cost as well as I do, and don't try to hide it, the penal lots I am now poking at. And the wee sort of was you should, if you were as bold a stroke now as the curate that christened you, Sonny doth the candle, repopulate the land of your birth and count up your progeny by the hungered head and angered the angered thousand, but you thwarted. Alrighty, that is page number one hundred eighty-eight. <sighs> of Jeff Finnegan's Wake. Good night.